आजकल समुंदर में हलचल कुछ ज्यादा बढ़ गई है भारत की बढ़ती आर्थिक और सामरिक ताकत ने कुछ ताकतों को ईर्ष्यावर द्वेष से भर दिया है अरब सागर में हाल में हुए यमी चैम्पलूटो पर ड्रोन हमले और कुछ पहले लाल सागर में यमी साईं बाबा पर हुए हमले को भारत सरकार ने गंभीरता पूर्वक लिया है भारतीय सौ नौसेना ने समुंदर की निगरानी बढ़ा दी है जिन्होंने भी इस हमले को अंजाम दिया है उन्हें हम सागर तल से भी ढूंढ निकालेंगे और उनके खिलाफ कठोर कार्रवाई की जाएगी मैं यहां आपको आश्वस्त करना चाहता हूं साथियों भारत पूरे इंडियन ओशन रीजन में नेट सिक्योरिटी प्रोवाइडर की भूमिका में है हम सुनिश्चित करेंगे कि इस इलाके में होने वाले समुद्री व्यापार सागर से उठकर आसमान की बुलंदियों तक पहुंचे इसके लिए हम मित्र देशों के साथ मिलकर सी लेंस को मैरिटाइम कामर्स के लिए सेफ और सिक्योर बनाए रखेंगे The Indian Navy has deployed three stealth guided missile destroyers to the Arabian Sea in response to an attack on the vessel MV Chem Pluto. It is a Japan owned chemical tanker with ties to Israel. The strike occurred on December 23rd in the Indian Ocean prompting heightened security measures by the Indian government. The Ministry of Defence released a statement late on Monday indicating that the destroyers were strategically positioned to maintain a deterrent presence amid a recent surge in attacks in the Arabian Sea. Long-range maritime patrol aircraft are also being utilized for enhanced domain awareness. India's Defence Minister Rajnath Singh addressed the issue. Jinhone bhi is hamle ko anjaam diya hai, unhe hum sagar tal se bhi dhoond nikalenge aur unke khilaf kathor karwai ki jayegi. Main yahan aapko aashwast karna chahta hu. The United States has pointed fingers at Iran alleging that the attack on MV Chem Pluto was fired from Iran. Tehran has vehemently denied these claims, dismissing them as baseless. This incident marks the first time the US has directly implicated Iran in such an attack outside the Red Sea. Regional tensions are escalating not only in the Red Sea but also across the Arabian Peninsula. The Indian government is currently investigating the nature of the attack on MV Chem Pluto which safely anchored in Mumbai on Monday. Initial assessments point to a drone attack but further forensic and technical analysis is needed to determine the precise vector of the attack. A Pentagon spokesperson said that the MV Chem Pluto, a Japanese owned tanker was hit while 200 nautical miles off the coast of India. It has caused a fire that was quickly extinguished with no casualties reported. This incident adds to the growing concern for maritime shipping globally with the Red Sea being a focal point for threats from Yemen's Houthi rebels. The Houthis have vowed to target any Israeli linked vessel in solidarity with Gaza. Despite the establishment of a new US led task force, there hasn't been an increase in ships attempting to pass through the Red Sea. Dozens of cargo ships remain stranded in Djibouti, reflecting the growing challenges to maritime trade. Meanwhile, Iran denies any coordination with the Houthis and insists that they operate independently. As tensions rise and uncertainty looms, the global community watches closely. as naval forces maintain a vigilant presence in the arabian sea subscribe to one india channel and never miss an update